Okay guys, these aren't tacky anymore. So forgive me, I'm filming with my left hand because I have to paint with my right hand. And I shook these two up really good. And I'm just gonna paint this on there. And you wanna do kind of a thick coat so that it has something to shatter. If you do it too thin, you probably won't see it. And sorry if some of this goes off camera. And I don't know if these polishes are available anymore. I know some of them you can find. I've seen the gold at Ulta recently, but I have not seen the silver. I know they always have the um, the red and the black and the basic colors available if you want the OPI stuff. But um, I was just at Walgreens this week and they do have like, there's a whole shelf of shatters and they have everything from like lime green to like your regular yellows and reds and pinks. And you can kind of see that it's shattering right now. So I'm gonna let that one sit. Well, maybe I'll put a little bit more silver in the corner there. And you don't wanna put two layers on it, so you wanna get your layer done right away because if you put another layer on it, you won't see through it and it probably won't shatter as much so I'm gonna leave that one to the side I'm gonna paint the turquoise one I love this turquoise it's so pretty over black and stuff like that um, this red though I would caution using over black because I mean on nails I haven't tried it in um, resin yet because I only did four um, clear hearts that I let cure for a couple days but um, let's see here I do really like this color though because it has kind of like the a shimmer in it too it's not just like a strict blue color they do have a navy and a like a lighter blue out two that they normally have in stores if you would look at like a Sally Beauty or something like that. I know the white is always available, the black and normally the red, but I don't know about the this one, the turquoise one, or the um, the silvers and the golds. But you can always try online. eBay is always a good place. I get, I'm kind of a nail buff, so I do get a lot of my polishes on eBay like this finger paints one it's sold out um, from my Sally Beauty within the day that they put it out because Ulta doesn't carry that but I have seen this one at Ulta and I think I've seen it at Target too Target does sell some OPI stuff okay and if you do get it on the side you can just use a uh, nail polish remover to get it off of there or it'll you know it'll come out on your piece but this is what this one looks like there's some pretty big cracks in it I did do it kind of thick on this one just because I didn't want to tip over the nail polish so I left it kind of thick on the brush but it does kind of have that foil effect on the outside and I think it'll look really good and I'll show them um, in a reveal once I get them done. I don't know when I'm gonna pour resin next. I was hoping tonight. But this is what it looks like when it dries and make sure it's dry before you pour the resin on because it might react with the resin. I, I let mine sit for at least two hours before I um, put another layer of resin in it. And you can see the pink I did more. The more brush strokes you do most of the time the more crackle you get from what I've done on my nails and then just doing these few here. This one, 
I put on thick so it's got less cracks, like I said, because I didn't want to tip over the nail pot. But if you put it on thinner, you'll probably get more cracks and more brush strokes, you'll probably get more cracks. But I'll show you guys when I get these done. And like I said, they sell this stuff at Walgreens and, you know, any like CVS or someplace like that where they sell nail polish, you'll probably find some type of crackle polish if you did want to try this. So I hope you guys found this maybe a little useful or inspirational if you want to try it. Um, like I said, eBay is a good place to find this stuff too if you don't have a pharmacy or you know, just a drugstore near you. So, bye guys.